Well, it's a boxing match, isn't it? So, uh, <laughs> of course, Mayweather's as good as it gets. Maybe one of the best boxers of all time. Maybe the best, I should say, of all time. So, yeah, yeah Mayweather will win in a boxing match. But is there any way that Conor can win, Mike? Well, listen, Floyd is known as a defensive master. 49 and all. Greatest boxer of all time, I'm not so sure. But let's remember, he's taking on this guy, Two Belt Tommy. And he's Two Belt Tommy for a reason. Of course, I'm talking about Conor McGregor because he has that crazy knockout power. He's gone in there and he's knocked out people time after time after time. And I'll tell you, every time I underestimate the guy and I think he's going to lose, he always proves me wrong. Of course, he can't go forward. He can't rush Floyd Mayweather. Right. He would run into his trap. Floyd Mayweather's going to counter all day long. He is the master of defense. But, as we've seen time and time again, it only takes one good shot. Listen, I've seen both these guys in person. Connor is significantly bigger. Now, I think the way that he wins this is by making it an ugly fight. If he can, if he can tie him up, if he can take away that momentum and take away the speed and not fight it from the outside and maybe look for a way either to just make it a, a brawl as opposed to a boxing match, I don't think that's going to happen. Mayweather is just, he's too good. He's fought the best that, there's, that there is. I love the way you cover your no own back you as you talk, because you know I'm going to interject and disagree, so you cover your own back. <laughs> that is what... Right. Boxer after boxer after boxer have said they're going to do. do. Right. We're going to rush him. We're going to make it ugly. We're going to brawl the boxer. Look at Ricky Hatton, you know, from a fellow Manchester guy. That's what he said. I'm just going to rush him. I'm going to make it ugly. Boom. He was out cold. Yeah, I'm not sure if Connor can win, but there is a way for Mayweather to lose if he underestimates him too much. Now, TMZ Sports caught up with Dana today. Here's what the UFC president had to say about Connor's future. I don't know. You know, he, he obviously has a lot of opportunities right now. Uh, Tony Ferguson is out there. Uh, you know, the Floyd Mayweather thing is out there. We'll see how this thing plays out. So Floyd Mayweather thing's still a possibility, though. Yeah, I mean, there's, there's. It doesn't make a lot of sense for my business, but I would never keep Connor from making that kind of money. Right. Everyone keeps wondering why you know the T-Mobile Arena was booked for June 10th. Yeah, is, is, is it any possibility it's for the Floyd Mayweather? It has fight? nothing to do with us. Well, it's crazy because Dana's saying there that the next fight he has is going to be Khabib or Tony Ferguson. But uh, I think this is another situation where we're going to see Conor versus the UFC. How's this going to play out, Kenny? Well, you know what? It's interesting. He didn't say it wasn't going to necessarily no, happen. That's true, so, true. You know, to me, I, I think that that's kind of a sign that this fight between Floyd Mayweather and McGregor is going to happen. Well, there's a very good possibility. They've yeah. even booked an arena, but who knows?